Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel on August 3rd, 2025. Question, can having more mitochondria and more mitochondrial density make you stronger? I mean, literally increase your strength? Let's tackle this question, now in my opinion, with scientific evidence. Because recently I saw a PhD who was investigating how to reverse the age of a mitochondria. He says he shot him. He gave mitochondria to a mouse, a lot of mitochondria, and the mouse instantly got 30% stronger. Here's the clip right here. Can I take a mouse and give it, a, and we do this all the time, give them a whole bunch of mitochondria and maybe exosomes too. And then can I look a month later and see that that mouse has became 30% stronger and 30% better cognition and can knock out sepsis. And we've done all three of those things. We've done strength, we've done cognition, and we've done immune system function, and they all work. Okay, so let's tackle this. Let's, is he right? Can you, can you possibly get 30% stronger just by injecting mitochondria? Let's see if he is correct. So what makes you stronger? What fibers are used to make you stronger? What do you need to do? There's only one way to get stronger, and that's training. You have to train for strength, not jogging. Not long distance, you have to train to get stronger. And as you go on, you add more weight and you get stronger. 30%, that's like benching 300 pounds and I shoot you up a mitochondria, boom, you're not benched 400 pounds. Man, could you imagine what people will do in the Olympics? But anyway, let me get back to the fibers. It is well known in science. Type one is for endurance, right on the screen right here, endurance training. A lot of long distance runners, elite marathon runners, they are full of type one muscle fibers. Now for strength, right on the screen, type two, type two A, type two X, those are for strength and power. That's what you need to train, those fibers. Now here's the problem. When you jog, when you run long distance, you increase your mitochondria in your body. It's called mitochondrial biogenesis. What does this mean? Mitochondria, the more mitochondria you have, the more type one muscle fibers act, get activated. Not type two, type two X, because that's what it does. It gives you ATP, it gives you more energy, more endurance. You don't fatigue as fast. So you are training your type one fibers. So the more mitochondria you shoot, the more type one you activate. Type two, type two A, type two X, take a nap, they go to sleep. That's why, because if he's right, that means because elite marathon runners, keep joking, two hours, 26.2 miles. If he's right, that means keep joking, go to the gym, get on the, on the bench and rep 500 pounds. I mean, if, he, if, his logic, if, he's, if his logic is correct, this guy's full of mitochondria. So the more mitochondria you have, the stronger you are, according to him. But he's wrong. It's the other way around. It's clear. It's clear. Here's the freaking study right on the screen. Mitochondria, the more you have, the more type 1 fibers. Type 1 fibers, I'll repeat it. It's for endurance, not strength. Mitochondria, so if you shoot mitochondria, you don't get stronger, you get more endurance, but you get weaker. So my question is, how in the world did this mouse get 30% stronger? Hmm? What did he do? There's no data, there's no video footage, nothing. He just, just take his word for it. Bottom line is this, this is a short video. Mitochondria does not increase strength. It increases your energy level so you can work out longer but it doesn't increase your power or your strength. It does the complete opposite. That's why marathon runners are the weaker athletes compared to every athlete in the world. They have the best endurance. But when it comes to strength and power, come on, they're at the bottom. Look, you believe what you want to believe. I've been doing this for a long time. I don't have, a, I don't have to have a PhD. I don't have to have a PhD. I've been doing this longer than PhDs, and I don't mean no disrespect by this. I've been studying this since I was 16 years old. You keep on believing the, these, these scientists making these bold claims. 
that uh, inject the mitochondria will make 30% stronger. And he, he said he's done it many times. Okay, show me. Show me. Anyway, have a wonderful day. I just wanted to answer the question that mitochondria does not increase strength at all. At all. Type 2A, type 2X, glycolytic, anaerobic, type 1, aerobic. That's what mitochondria works, the aerobic system. Anyway, have a wonderful day. See you soon in my next video.